Hello students, today we are going to see how we can name an ester, okay. Now this ester is going is not going to be a simple molecule, there's going to be a bit of a challenge here with some substituents. Anyway, just go ahead and look at it. So this is the ester here. As we can see, the, the pink color of the structure encompasses the acid part, okay. CS3C, CS3 twice, CS2, CS2, C, C double bond O and then we have also got the alcohol part of the ester which is the O, you know, cycloxyl ring with the chloro group. See, we know that any ester con consists of a part that comes from the acid and a part that comes from the alcohol because we know that, you know, esters are made by the acid catalysis, you know, reaction of carboxylic acid and alcohol okay so having established the acid part and alcohol part let us first look at the alcohol part see the alcohol part which as we see is 2 chlorocyclohexanol how are we getting this name see the carbon bearing the hydroxyl group as per UPC will be number one and the carbon bearing the chloro group has to get the lowest number so it will be number two and then three, four, five, and six. Okay, we can see the numbering of the ring. So this will be a two chlorocyclohexanol, but we are more concerned with the alkyl part. Alkyl part of two chlorocyclohexanol is two chlorocyclohexyl. How? Methyl alcohol, the alkyl part is methyl, ethyl alcohol, the alkyl part is ethyl. So for this compound, two chlorocyclohexanol, the alcohol part is two chlorocyclohexyl. Okay, now we look at the acid part. The acid part, once again, we do the IUPAC naming of the acid part. We can see that acid is 4,4-dimethyl-pentanoic acid. You see the carbon bearing the carboxyl group will get number 1 and we number it from right to left. Okay, so the two methyl groups are on carbon 4. So that's why it's 4,4-dimethyl-pentanoic acid. Now what we do is, from the pentanoic acid, we remove the oic acid and we put O8. Okay, O8. So this will become 4,4-dimethyl pentanoate. Now, all we have to do is just combine these two names. So it will be 2-chlorocyclohexyl 4,4-dimethyl pentanoate. So in the future, if you see any ester, all you have to do is the name properly, the IUPAC name of the alkyl part of the al alkyl moiety of the alcohol part and also the acid part you have to name and put an O8 and combine the names. It's that simple. But you always mention the alcohol part first and then you mention the acid part second. Okay. So th that's all I wanted to tell you for this today's lesson. Thank you very much. Bye.